Eileen was a summary of art and knowledge, made of the finest and strongest materials. After being marooned for 20 years, her planking, in perfect four centimeters thick Burma, escaped from the time and the elements, and the composite hull had not lost any of its symmetry. The project of her restoration was undertaken by a team of craftsmen at the Francesco del Carlo boatyard in Viareggio. It took more than two years to give Eileen a new dress. The hull was composed of frames, floor timbers, beams, and reinforcements in zinc-plated metal. And the team selected by Officine Panerai to restore Eileen used the same technique as in the 30s to rebuild it as it was. The original Fife dragons have once again been carved on the hull, just like they were originally, with their heads on the bows and their tails on the stern, and the name Eileen found its place in the wood on the transom, as it was at the root of the project. Following the layout of the original plans, the teak cockpit was rebuilt in Eileen's stern and fitted with its original features, such as the wooden steering wheel and the column of the brass compass. All the equipment and rigging have been replaced, including seven new bronze winches, all manual and double speed, with no electric or hydraulic mechanisms. Eileen's original deck house was dismantled and carefully restored, maintaining its original 1936 shape and camber. The original bronze portholes and all the windows were also dismantled, reconditioned and remounted. The boom and bow spirit were totally rebuilt with timber from just one perfectly seasoned tree from Alaska. The mainmast boom measures nine meters in length and the one on the mizzenmast six meters. At the end of 2009, Eileen, after her relaunch in La Spezia, in a ceremony provided by the Italian Navy, has been returned to her original splendor.